guys, it's Hazza here with another Farming Simulator video. Today we're going to be checking out the Smith Trailer Pack. You can get these from the in-game mod centre. First thing, let's check out this trailer. First thing I notice on both of these trailers is the extreme level of detail that has gone to make. Nice field master logos, mud flaps. Let's just zip it around the back. Tires are amazing. What Michelin tires? Back is quite amazing. With the, the long mud guide, this trailer can also tow another trailer. I'm pretty sure with the tow hook. Double the lights and the cover on the lights are really nice, and I love the hazard light, little hazard light there. It's also got an Irish number plate, so just note that. Let's move on to this one. This one is primarily used for silage, because of the large top for forage harvesters. Forage harvesters all get to go into the top. So this one is basically the same as the other one. I'm just going to zip over here and grab a tractor and hook it on. You may recognise this tractor from my last video, so let's just jump. Hold quite a bit of grain as well. Hold all crops, which is nice. Hoses are quite nice too. On this trip, I'm going to be talking a bit about my channel and what, I, what my plans are, and even more about this trailer. Sorry, my last video I didn't have any sound. It was because my um, my headphones hadn't quite arrived. Oh, good. Because my headphones hadn't quite arrived, so that's why you couldn't couldn't hear anything, and there was just text on it. But I love the great response everyone's had to that video. Thanks. I'm pro I'm planning to do lots more farming simulator videos in the future. Hopefully, thoughts of videos too. Right, before I go onto the road, I'm just gonna turn traffic on so I'm not so lonely. That way or that way? Go this way. Those of you who haven't seen Cobble Park Farm before, great map, you should definitely download it. You just go from the in game mod center. Oh, I'm just ducking. Whoa, crash of holy cheese balls. Sorry about that, my bad driving. It's a bit hard to talk, drive, and look around at the same time. So I'll just give you a look at the mini map. So the BJ is up the top, and the f there's a T stands for forest. There's three main farms. There's Yatton Ridge Farm, Chantry Charity Chantry Farm, I think. Old Park Farm. This is version three, and. There's roughly about 34, 35 fields in this map. All the cell points and things are down the bottom, apart from the BGAs right at the top. Let's get back to driving. Down here you're going to be able to see one of my Easter eggs for my next video. If any of you recognize, or find, know, think you know what it is, please comment down below. And if you guess it correctly, I will shout out shout you out in the next video. Ace Deutz here. I'm going to just pull in here and dump the grain in the grain cell point and show you the animation triggers in a bit around this map. So I hope you enjoy. Pull up. Click on the light so you can see lights down there. I've actually uncoupled from the trailer. Oops. The lights will swing now. I'm just going to dump the grain. Hopefully, I'll get some money. 
The animation trigger is quite nice on this trailer. I really quite like it. Yeah, this trailer is good for, like this is quite powerful John Deere and it can be pulled by this. I think this tractor's got 200 and something horsepower, 245 horsepower, so big tractors, tra like 400 tractors, oh gold nugget, I'll get that. Tractors can easily pull it, not look weird on it. May not have the biggest capacity, but it's definitely a great trailer. I use it for just about everything. One of my friends actually told me about it, so shout out to him. Grab that golden nugget. One step closer to getting it. So. With this video, I've been Hazza. See ya.